wants to push to buy clean. That's the message that President Biden administration is sending tonight. White House officials made a stop in Topeka today to announce a $2 billion nationwide project. 27 News Kansas Capitol Bureau Chief Rebecca Chung tells us where all that money could go. Yeah, White House officials made that announcement here at the Frank Carlson building in Topeka. $25 million of that money is going to giving this building an upgrade, along with more than 150 other projects across the U.S. The Biden-Harris administration is about to give thousands of federal office buildings, like this one here in Topeka, a revamp. That's why I'm so excited about concrete. Who would have thought? <laughs> They're investing in low embodied carbon, or LEC material, a cleaner alternative, they say, compared to regular concrete, asphalt, and steel. It's really a game changer for American industry, for American workers, and communities across the country, and of course for our planet by reducing the carbon load of those materials. Starting in 2025, they're remodeling the Frank Carlson Federal Office Building in Topeka. Windows and doors will be replaced with LEC glass and sidewalks and parking areas will be upgraded with LEC concrete. And this is all being made possible by dollars from the IRA, the Inflation Reduction Act. The Inflation Reduction Act, the largest climate investment in history, provided more than $3 billion to invest in federal buildings to help reduce carbon emissions, which can come from the production process of material like concrete. The material will be used to help meet the administration's goal to reach net zero for federal office buildings over the next two decades. It's exciting to be in a position now where we can ask for this and the industry is saying, sure, we can produce this. And the impact is fantastic. And officials say they're trying to use the government's purchasing power to push the market toward buying cleaner construction materials for projects like these. For now, reporting live in downtown Topeka, I'm Rebecca Chung.